Hi, I'm Hillary Shine, and this is Good News, Killeen. It's the end of summer, and we're looking forward to fall. Here's what's headed your way. The COVID-19 situation continues, and the mask mandate remains in place. Statewide and local numbers are showing a downward trend, which is great news. But the virus is still among us, so we can't let our guards down. To continue our fight against the spread, Killeen is hosting three more mobile testing sites this week. All are from noon to 8 p.m. and free. August 27th is at the Killeen Civic and Conference Center. August 28th is at Leo Buckley Stadium. And August 29th is at Shoemaker High School. Appointments are required and can be made online at texas.curativeinc.com, beginning 24 hours in advance. September is National Preparedness Month. Every year, Killeen joins in marking the month to remind residents to plan for emergencies before disaster strikes. This year's theme is Disasters Don't Wait, Make Your Plan Today. Having a plan for yourself and your family can make a huge difference when time is of the essence. Things like knowing where to go in your house in cases of severe weather, where to meet if you get displaced or separated, having all your important documents in one place to grab if you have to evacuate can and should be planned in advance. COVID-19 presents an additional challenge you should anticipate, so follow CDC guidelines when putting together supply kits. Ready.gov has lots of great resources to help you during National Preparedness Month and every month. It was fun while it lasted, but swim season has come to an end this summer. The Family Aquatic Center and Long Branch Pool are now closed until Memorial Day weekend 2021. The Family Rec Center courts have a fresh new look. The courts were resurfaced and restriped just in time to welcome fall youth volleyball. There's still time to register your boys and girls ages 7 to 12 for camp and for league play. Camp is three two-hour training sessions with Coach Eva Serrano, September 19th and 26th and October 3rd for $65 a player. Co-ed Youth League is $50 per player through September 4th. Ability assessments by age division will be September 12th and the season runs October 17th through November 21st. Registration is open online at killingtexas.gov KPR or in person at the Family Rec Center. Fall youth baseball and softball are also registering now. This year, registration is by team, so travel, select, and showcase teams can compete in a winner-take-all eight-game season September 21st through October 30th. There will be 10 teams per division. Girls can compete in 10 and under, 12 and under, and 15 and under. Boys' divisions are 10 and under, 11 and under, and 12 and under. Team registration is $100 and must be received by September 18th. Labor Day is September 7th, and your hard-working city employees are looking forward to a little time off. As always, emergency services and garbage collection will operate without interruption. We hope you and yours have a safe, long weekend, and we'll see you back September 8th. What else is happening in Killeen? Find out at KilleenTexas.gov, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, and Spectrum Cable Channel 10. Until next time, this is Good News Killeen.